Hey, what's up, my Glayblocks, and welcome to episode 23 of my Pokemon Emerald Nuzlocke Challenge. Last time we met uh, Wallace, the Pokemon uh, um, champion, and this time, this episode, we have to go find Rayquaza down at the Sky Pillar, which I believe is by Pacific Log Town. Now, I have to go all the way around, which sucks. Oh, phew. Uh, what the name of the Lord is going on with my keyboard? <laughs> yeah, my keyboard was screwing up right there. I don't know why. Stop it. God, my keyboard hates me. I know it. No, another battle. God. My lord, um, yeah, so, we're, we are actually almost done the game, actually. There's only a little bit left, and then there's the Elite Four. Let's use Hyper Meme to the face syndrome. As, uh, quoted by Jerome ASF and Bayesian Canadian. During that Pixelmon series. <laughs> Which I am actually having trouble downloading or I'm modding my Pixelmon, guys. Um, it's pretty difficult actually. My, my Minecraft Forge doesn't work on my computer, so I am stuck with a vanilla Minecraft. As odd as that sounds, it's true. <laughs> Yeah. So as odd as that sounds, I cannot mod my uh, my Minecraft. I can only texture pack it, which is actually pretty cool because I like the texture packs that some people have actually come up with. I've downloaded a couple. Use. I've been using one more, Leslie, in my Minecraft videos, which shall be back sometime, guys, uh, my Minecraft survival. I might have to uh, go on to a different computer, actually, and to get the forge and all that st stuff done. It It's weird. I don't know. What to say about that? And we are almost oh so close to Pacific Log. We were almost there, then we got interrupted by this battle. That, that's the worst part about traveling by sea. You can be interrupted in the middle of speech. But HPS hyper means like. I don't even know how to how it's how it's acronymed. Hyper beam to the face syndrome. H B T F S. Hyper beam to the face syndrome. Since there's two T's, I don't know if you acronym both T's or not. Um, anybody that needs anybody that knows that. Uh, <laughs> Comment down below how it's acronymed, please, so that I know this stuff. Oh, double battle, no! I hate double battles. I almost lost to Tate and Liza in the two episodes ago, I believe it was. I almost lost to them. It wasn't the most fun experience ever. But... I believe I can beat these guys quite easily. A dragon breath. Yeah, that was quite easy, actually, guys. Um, ah. I'm sorry for the lack of videos lately, guys. Um, I know that a lot of people have been wanting me to continue with this Emerald and Nuzlocke and then get back to my Minecraft Ruby and Momon Fire Red series. Which is quite understandable, actually, because I know a lot of people like Minecraft in this world. 
<laughs> but I still have my facts and trivia's videos and those cover videos those are going to be stopped I will not be doing cover videos anymore I will be removing those from my channel because anything that can be copyrighted nowadays will be copyrighted it, it's dumb YouTube I don't even want to rant about this right now because I'm, I'm just into the game uh, and all of you guys, there's other videos out there that you can go see if you want to hear rants on this. But I I'm not just, I'm not going to rant. Not on that. Hey, we're at Pacific Log Town, which I can't run through the log, which is weird, because usually you can run through them. So anyway, guys, I am going to be flying back to Moss deep and buying some more ultra balls because I've run out actually ever since that chinchow got away from me I ran out of pokeballs and I never thought to restock so I want some ultra balls please give me about holy I have a lot of money I didn't even notice that money there wow Let, let's just buy 30 of them. I don't know how. Oh, right. I was training off screen quite a bit. So I, I got quite a lot of money. Yeah. And selling items too. Uh, I was black marketing items. Don't worry about it, guys. Nothing to worry about. I, I was just doing a lot of off screen stuff. So, time to fly back on over to Pacific Log. Ah, I hate super speedy. This thing super speeds on its own sometimes, and it really messes me up. Because I can't fly properly. No, go around the hem. No, I didn't want to. I... Why? Let's hyper baby you. Because I can. Hyperbeam to the face syndrome. Bam. <laughs> yeah, that was a lot of off screen stuff, by the way, if you didn't know. By the way, Crowbar, for some reason, still hasn't evolved, even though he's level 55. I do not know what's going on with him. Because I thought his happiness would be great by now since I got him at level 16, but whatever. He'll evolve in his own time. But until that day, we're stuck with a Golbat. And just up here, I believe it is... Yep, yeah, there's the Sky Pillar. And Wallace unlocked it already, apparently. I believe he says he's already unlocked it. go up here and there's Wallace See? oh my I'm terribly solely sorry in my haste I didn't know that you were left behind I op I've opened the locked door on the sky pillar of the sky pillar clay let's be on our way um <laughs> well uh, looks like um Wallace is going back to Sutopolis and leaving us in charge of the Sky Pillar, which you actually need the Mach Bike to beat. I know this is weird, but you actually do need the Mach Bike. And I already have a Golbot Bat, so that's Dupe's Claws right there. Since this is a new area, after all. Uh, second floor. Oh wait, you don't actually need the mock bike the first time you come in here. You need it the second time. And there's a Sableye. That's a Pokemon I really didn't care for, but wanted to use in this series, actually. Oh, that's right. Inner Focus stops me from flinching. But I'm not going to be catching a Sableye. 
I'm going to be saving my Pokeballs until I get the, the Beldum that was promised to me, that I know I can get. Um, okay, what you need to do is you need to get to the far one. No, it was the middle one. Darn it, I didn't think it was the far one. I thought it was the far one, but no, it was the middle two that you needed to get to. Um, so yeah, a clay doll. A flipping clay doll. Just, no. No. I, I spent all that time training up a Beldum, and there was a clay doll right there. <laughs> wow. I love having inner focus, because it prevents flinching. And I can just beat up Sableye's left, right, and center. It's quite fun. And we're at the top of Sky Pillar. And there. That's Rayquaza. Oh. Um, no. Wait, Rayquaza, wait! Ah. Well, I think I know where it flew off to, but I'm not a hundred percent sure on it. I think he went back to Sutopolis. <laughs> Let's fly over there and find out. Hey, another cutscene. Two episodes in a row to get cutscenes, guys. Wow. So you guys are pretty lucky with those cutscenes. And there comes Rayquaza. Well, um, okay. I wish I could screenshot that. No, that was awesome. <laughs> wow, Rayquaza just absolutely pushed them away. That's pretty cool, actually. Well, everything's back to normal. Good. Now I think I can challenge the Sutopolis gym in the next episode, guys. <laughs> Okay, I I've, I've heard what you had to say once already. Well, HM07, that would be waterfall. You need the rain badge to use it. Okay, and there's Steven. Now let's just walk in and walk back out. And they're both still sit standing there. Well, guys, in the next episode of Pokemon Emerald Nuzlocke Challenge, I will be taking on the Sutopolis Gym. It's quite an easy gym puzzle, actually. So I'll see you guys in the next episode.